it's already like seems like it's already pre optimized. So after after this goes up at the top, it's already it's already optimized. And then let me see how the uh checkout page looks like. So this is the checkout page. Um it looks like the Shopify checkout page, but again, um it can be customizable. I'm gonna I'm gonna go ahead and fill this out. Um so hold on. Okay. Twenty dollars for international shipping. O M G. Hold on. Okay, so there was a problem with the payments. Contact us. All right, so um, I haven't set up the checkout the the checkout yet, but the shipping is ridiculous. Twenty dollars for international shipping. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and add a shipping policy. So this is the policy pages where I can create from a template. Oh, and that is pretty much it. I just press the button and it's done. Privacy policy, press the button and it's done. Um, terms of service, press the button and it's done. And shipping policy. Uh, it's, so shipping cost varies depending on the shipping destination, number of items you purchase, you can get a calculation of the exact shipping blah 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 um so standard shipping time is five to ten days seven fifteen days for international you know what i think it's more like 10 okay there we go that's pretty much it we'll just keep it at that for now and continue um so if i'm selling it for 25 dollars it's a 15 dollar profit um Unfortunately, I'm just gonna sell it for nine. Actually, yeah, twenty-five dollars. That's that's good. I could discount it on a on a special day or offer a five dollar discount and check out. So those are healthy margins. Fifteen dollar margin. I'm one click launch. Here we go. Um. And uh. We're just waiting for it to, to load. It's live. Okay, it's live. It is live. Okay, we're going to go back here and then refresh. This is, this is the apps. And this is my store, by the way, on, on ShopBase. As you can see up here, it's on ShopBase.com. And I got the two apps here. So using Print Hub, I should have one new product because I just added, I added the product right here. So that's my product um the analytics of course uh does there's nothing right now because i'm just making it the discounts uh i could create a discount so i want to create a discount for uh for specific products 